Well, we are talking about dining al fresco this morning. Our series highlighting the best spots to dine outside in the valley, and uh, this is one of our favorites. Sure. Not together, but we both love this place. I I'll go to lunch with okay. you there. You no problem. Too. I do. I think you owe me, don't you? No. Yeah, I owe you one nothing. Bag? <laughs> no, definitely not. Uh, this time we're headed to Chelsea's Kitchen in Phoenix. So uh, we'll head out to Stephen, who is live on the patio with a look. I think, actually, I, the last time I was on that patio was with Gina and Tess in April. <laughs> really? Yeah. All right. Hey, we got plenty of seats for you guys to come stop on by. But yeah, it is patio season. Let me just paint the picture for you. You can hear those birds chirping. Got the fire crackling. And of course, it wouldn't be patio weather without delicious food and drinks. And I'm joined with Michaela to talk about what Chelsea's Kitchen has to offer. And the food not only looks delicious, but it smells delicious. When y'all bring it in, I was, my mouth was water. It's, it is delicious. Thank you very much. So yeah, let's go through the each item y'all y'all have. Yeah, so these are some of our staple dishes. Right over here, we're gonna have our crispy chicken sandwich. This bun is actually made by our bake shop just right down the road. We have chicken on there. We also have a spicy slaw that has a sriracha aioli, fresh Granny Smith apples, some pickles, um, our house-made barbecue, almost um, smoky seasoned french fries. Right over here, we have our vegetable enchilada. This is gonna be made with a tortilla that is going to be brought to us by Masa Fresca, which is a local company here that's going to have um, spaghetti squash, fresh tomato, artichoke heart, asadero cheese, our salsa verde, all baked together and brought out. Yeah, Over you were telling me that uh, a lot of y'all's ingredients are, lo are local. They are. We try to do our best to do everything sustainable, everything local as much as humanly possible. Um, that being said, can't forget the appetizer. Yep, the tuna tartare right over here is perfect patio weather appetizer. We're gonna have our um, ahi grade tuna, the number one from Hawaii, that's gonna be tossed in our house made ponzu sauce with that fresh citrus, a little bit of soy sauce, topped with our house made guacamole, of course, with our locally um, fried tortilla chips that we get from Masa Fresca as well. And then this item right here, that is gonna be our shrimp ceviche. So you like some ceviche? Ceviche is really nice, refreshing. It's mm -hmm. perfect for patio weather. So yeah, let's talk about the patio here. I mean, we got the nice trees, we got the fire. It's just a very casual place to just enjoy uh, some nice. food. Yeah, you can come here on a first date. Sometimes we get people who celebrate their anniversaries. We do birthdays, maybe just a colleague on a lunch. It's a perfect place to enjoy. And then we have some drinks as well. You Me know, too. some people like to drink when they're out on the patio, Absolutely. You know, myself included. So yeah. what sort of drinks have you brought here? Well, you can't go wrong with prickly pear margarita. This is so delicious. It's fresh ingredients. We use a Blanco tequila, fresh lime juice, fresh prickly pear, some agave with a little bit of a salt rim. And then over here we have a whiskey sour that's going to be topped with some egg whites to make it nice and foamy. Awesome. And so where can people stop by and have some of this delicious food and tasty drinks. This is Chelsea's Kitchen here in Phoenix. Nice. So yeah, we got plenty of seats for you guys. I know y'all were just talking about how this is one of y'all's favorite spots. Like I said, I can't finish all this food by myself. I'm going to try. But yeah, we got plenty of plenty of spots for y'all if y'all are looking to uh, stop by after the newscast. It's, it's, it's delicious. It's a great place. Yep, no doubt. 40th and Camelback. Have you